Hudson Valley headlines. We begin in Ulster County, where officials in New Paltz say the proposed budget for the village would increase the property tax levy. Authorities say the proposed budget for the 15-16 calendar year would be $7.7 .7 million and would require an increase in the property tax by 1.88%. The budget would include a raise for the mayor and four village board members. Officials in Kingston are backing a move that would ease snow parking for residents and local workers. Common Council voted in favor of legislation that would allow the public works superintendent to implement alternate side parking during snow emergencies. Authorities say it would also make it easier for crews to clear the roads. Kingston has a new EMS coordinator. Richard Mueller-Lyle is a career firefighter and paramedic. He once served as president of the Ulster EMS Council. Mueller-Lyle spoke with us today about the new post. EMS professionals, whether they be career or volunteer, are in the business of being there on the worst day of your life. It's my job to ensure that the hundreds of responders in Ulster County are provided with the tools and the knowledge to make that day better for those that need us. Still life photo of the day, going dancing. The Manhattan College Jaspers cutting down the nets after winning the MAC tournament over Iona and winning a slot in the NCAA tournament. They will now play in a play-in game tomorrow. They're one of three area teams in the big dance. The Great Danes at the University of Albany celebrating after winning the America East Conference title and winning a spot in the NCAA men's tournament. Albany's women's team also in their big dance and St. John's won an at-large bid as well. That is all the time we have for tonight. Thanks so much for being here. We're going to see you right back here tomorrow night at 6 for another edition of RFL. Until then, have a good night.